Tony Vieira, President of Wuffe Association Malmö, Sweden, and Project Manager and Youth Trainer within European Youth Programme Erasmus Plus, organizes training courses for youth workers, organized youth camps. Mission, to be good ambassador for youth in Europe, manage projects for youth work and European volunteer service. Hello everybody, I'm really happy to be here. Like come here and see and uh, listen to this wonderful um, people that are talking about something that is quite important for us, environment and uh, mobility and uh, to make our world a bit better. Well, anyway, uh, I come from Sweden. Uh, I work at a youth association called Youth in Europe. Uh, so uh, today I'm going to try to take the world record, Guinness record, to make a fast uh, lecture, okay? First of all, I'm going to tell you something uh, about uh, a big uh, youth European portal called Eurodesk, okay? And then I'm going to tell you a bit about the uh, youth program I call European Voluntary Service. And uh, I will finish uh, to tell you a little about the uh, uh, European youth program called Erasmus Plus, okay? This is uh, some kind of tools for young people, but not only for young people, but also for youth workers and adults, okay? To have a exchange and to see a little bit more about Europe, okay? Uh, so, uh, about Eurodesk, why people need to go to uh, Eurodesk uh, database? Well, uh, many of the people want to know how to study abroad, how to work abroad, what is my rights, what I have to do uh, when I come to another country, what kind of possibilities I have to go for voluntary uh, projects abroad, uh, how can I found that activities, where do I go, where do I start, uh, where uh, to found help to run a project. Um, okay, here we go. So, uh, the Eurodisc portal. If you have a chance, go to eurodesk.eu, European Union, okay. Uh, there you will find a lot of relevant information for young people and youth workers uh, in the field of education, training, youth, and mobility. Mobility, that's a difficult word. I made it. Uh, so, uh, take to the next, please. Uh, there is a lot of check sections that you found in this portal, studying, working, getting training, education, how to get involved, how can I go to, for example, to Spain to learn Spanish and meet people or help a youth education. Next one, please, thank you very much. Uh, as I told you, Eurodesk is a database where you can, for example, ask questions about Europe. For example, uh, how, uh, what is the best uh, thing to do in Ireland? So you can go to Eurodesk, Ireland, ask an Irish person, and in five seconds get the answer. Next one, please. Uh, we can jump to the next one because that one I already told. Uh, well, when you're making projects, uh, you always need to be involved in an organization. Okay, association, federation, or work. Uh, in that way, you can get involved and uh, participate in a lot of activities. Next one, please. Um, so we can jump to the next. The website uh, looks more or less like this. So you just have to click. There is 22 language. So uh, if you're not good in English, you can go to the next language. Thank you very much. Uh, so, as I said, here you can find all information about uh, all Europe. The is the European Commission is the one that I gave in the mission to Brussels Links to take care of your desk. Next one, here we go. Uh, okay, there is a youth program called Erasmus Plus that has a lot of uh, part programs. Okay. It's for people between 13 years old and 35 years old, okay? You can continue jumping. So, uh, as I said, if I want to live abroad, if I want to study, if I want to meet people, if I want to get involved 
uh, in a society. Uh, next one. Uh, so now I will tell you, for example, about the European Voluntary Service. Let's see that this man wants to go to Spanish to work for the municipality to help uh, the, the, the people uh, cleaning the streets for the municipality. There is a possibility that you can go to a database and search for a program and uh, get money to go abroad. So you will get paid for it. It doesn't cost anything. The European Commission pays everything. Russians can also participate if you found the European organization that can cooperate. To the next. I will leave this, uh, uh, this PowerPoint presentation uh, with this man and it will be a link so you can uh, get access to it. Let's jump to the next one. Uh, there is also a possibility that you can participate in camps with different themes about environment, about uh, looking for similarities, equalities, etc. Uh, and that you just have to go uh, inside the Eurodesk portal and look for information for that. Um, jumping, jumping, jumping. Next one, please. Yeah, we will do it. We can jump to the next, 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 because of this one. Um, Next one, please. Uh, next. Uh, and uh, there is also action called number four. As you see, you got a lot of such possibilities. Networking, training courses, participating in seminars, study visits, and so on. Jumping. Uh, and we can go to the next one. As I told you, the European European youth program called Erasmus Plus is where the, you can get funds to participate in all these projects. Next one, please. Uh, and here you can see people always uh, ask me about, for example, okay, I'm Russian or I'm from uh, Thailand or whatever. Can I participate? Yes, if you have a European country that is involved, that you can go. Next one, please. That's a nice guy, eh? Close. Thank you very much.